This is Song Gamers and we are here to do a new review for you and it is for the game um, <laughs> Oh no Okay uh, uh, One Third Weapons of Fate Yeah, you can see here It's uh, based on the movie One Third which was actually a very nice movie Yes And uh, yeah, let's have a look at the game uh, We are playing training now the first lesson was simple. I needed to know what it felt like to put a bullet. Uh, this game takes place after the, a few days after the movie. Yeah, uh, and I'm gonna shoot some uh, targets now, which are the human, the human bodies. What's the story? Uh, okay, so let's elaborate on the story. Those who so the movie, the story ended with. Uh, Wesley killing Sloan. Yeah, so uh, we take over from there, and uh, now he's now that he's become a fully trained assassin. Some people uh, think killing is just still going up, finding out what's the reason and uh, why Wesley was born and who was he born to and all that and his origins. Basically, he's trying to find out who his mother was and his father was. And there's also a guy who's trying to kill him since he was uh, young. So yeah. Family yep. Yeah, we see here. Sneak into some color. Okay, so we are in the army. Yeah, this is the army. Yeah, very smooth so far. Look at that. I gotta say the action looks really smooth. Uh, you be able to go through cover like that is pretty good. Yeah, you can. It's basically. Basically, it's just a gear to wall style cover system. And yeah, it's a very fun shooter. Uh, later, you'll be able to see some uh, power moves like uh, bullet curving. Yeah, you'll unlock it later in the game. This is just a basic training for you guys. Oh, I like their vulgarities. Yep, it's a very uh, M rated game. And I like the idea of. I like the idea of the being be able to curve bullets like in the movie. It is the trademark anyway. Yep, and we are trying to get some bullets here. And we are flanking around him with the, with the shield. Ouch! Yep. Your face cut that! <laughs> That's a classic line in song now. <laughs> yeah, killing people like a boss. It's like a chocolate house. So, uh, B, what do you think of this game so far? The action from hiding from places to places. Uh, this is not the first time I've seen it. The very first one is from PS2 game called uh, Gunslinger Girl. It's also a shooting game like this. But compared to Coffee Wise, of course, this is better. Let's see some uh, cover fire modes. Uh, you can distract him by firing some bullets, running over to the other side and take him out. Like that. You shot him in the arm! You shot him in the arm! <laughs> yeah, as you can see, today we are using a new uh, form of uh, camera mode. Uh, we like to call it ghost mode. Ghost cam. That's right. Because uh, I'm not holding the camera. And I ain't holding the camera. He's not holding the camera. No one's holding the camera. No one's holding the camera. So he's a ghost. Uh, let's call him ghost. Yeah, yeah, ghost. Alright. Oh boy. It's a knife. Ow! Yeah, these are close range kills. Oh, oh. I like. That is a very creative kill. Very yeah. creative. And those are quite the training. That's the training mode for you guys. And now I think we'll be getting into the to change history. further in the story. And let's have a look. Let's curve some bullets. Yep. Even though if you did watch Mythbusters, it is busted. Yep, it's true that you can't uh, curve bullets in real life, but you know, it's a cool thing. Everything you know about you. Yeah, and we're starting the story off now. And I am in control as the trophy says. You didn't think you were capable of. Trophy unlocked. I want to know why me. Well, okay, let's skip the cinematic and get into the gameplay. Okay, okay as you can see, is this is Wesley's apartment, apartment and it's being uh, torn down by some French guys. French assassins from the French clan of the assassins. 
Yep. It's not Ezio we're talking about, it's French. Oh, dude. Ezio's not French, he's Italian. That's why I'm telling these people, in case they don't know. They might not tell the difference between. In this story, uh, the main uh, enemies are from the French assassination group. And we're about to take down some assholes. Um, w, what do you think about this game so far? Well, uh, yeah, looking at the games, uh, I, I really like the actions of uh, all how to dodge, how to run for places and places. It's very practical. I mean, like, the beast. Yeah. Uh, got some uh, very, uh, very awesome moves uh, from what I see. And then for the gameplay, it's a first person shooter, I mean, not first person, third person shooter, first shooter game, uh, which I seldom touch. Uh, I mean, yeah. For, I mean, for this game, is, uh, I can see it actually really good. Yeah. Okay, let's get back into some gameplay and we'll try to get down these uh, French assassins. Here comes the cavalry. Uh, as you can see, there is no light bar. Uh, it's quite the same similar system to uh, Modern Warfare, where you see the blood on the screen and you have to recover by hiding. And we're gonna beat some Frenchies with baguettes. <laughs> oh, we're gonna use bullets. Okay, and another cutscene. Okay, uh, for the cutscenes wise, I think they are uh, not that in great quality because uh, compared to the in-game visuals, they look better than the cutscenes. Because you can see certain... Uh, uh, not, not say so great qualities about it. It's a bit... Um, imperfect or yeah, yeah, imperfect and it has a lot of squares on it. Like you can see some of the squares on the, on the screen or something. Yeah, and uh, yeah, the, the cinematics, I gotta say that uh, it looks kinda... It would look good for a game that came from the PS2. Yeah, but that yeah, might okay. As long as the game's great. Yeah. No, in order for the game to move this fast, or the gameplay to move this fast, or, they have to sacrifice certain graphics. Yeah, kind of true what he said. To enhance the movement. And just like Metal Gear. Yeah. So if you don't mind the graphics being laggy or what, you can pick up this game, it's very great. Uh, what do you think, uh, what do you like to rate this game, guys? Uh, I'd like to give it, okay, no offense. I'm thinking of giving it like a, a 6 out of 10 or 6. Okay, for one thing, the gameplay, it looks sharp. Uh, I love the movement from cover and the action looks great. And the coming bullet feature is awesome too. Yeah, which I'm gonna show you in a few minutes. The main trouble here is that they lack in the graphics area for cinematics. Story-wise, it's so-so. Um, and uh, kind of disappointing for a game uh, released uh, during that time of year. So I'll stick a six. What about you, W? Yeah, I'll give it a seven. So uh, partly because they have graphics. But then uh, for me, right, graphic doesn't really matter as long as it's fun to play and yeah. So uh, um, yeah, that's pretty much about it. Because uh, for uh, shooting games, I'm not really so fond of it. So B. I have no issue with the graphics. The gameplay wise is flexible. I give it eight. You want me to shoot your other guy? What did you take from that picture? <laughs> and I like the way they. I like, I like the way they talk. <laughs> Just There's a lot of cussing in the game. Yeah. Yeah. Great dial. And what about you, what about you Ed? So, um, okay, I am a huge uh, movie games fan. So, uh, I'm not gonna give it a full score because there are some imperfections, but. I think I'll give it an 8.5. Yeah. Uh, one thing about movie games, this is one of the best I've ever seen. And this is one of the most fun games, movie games you can get out there. Uh, you can also try Terminator, which was made by the same company, Warner Brothers Interactive. Uh, but it's not as great as this because it doesn't have the bullet curving feature and all that. It's just basically a cover shooter. So yeah, you can... Uh, when I Between uh, this and uh, Terminator, I would recommend you choose Wanted because it's 
because you have the curving bullet feature and also yeah and it's quite fun to play but some of the features that I don't like are the sniping moments and the turret gunning moments because uh, even though you are behind cover you are still getting shot a lot yeah so that's one of my uh, one of the reasons why I gave it like 8.5 only so yeah let's get back into more gameplay and eventually we're gonna see some bullet curving yep hopefully soon Behind cover, especially. Yeah, speaking of, you know, we're going to the subject of movie games. A lot of these have been, you know, very uh, rushed products. Not exactly the best. Yeah, but this game came after a few, a few years, a yeah, few months after the movie came out. So at least so this one has, a, yeah, had, a, had some time. They had some time to iron out the things. It may be a bit disappointing. But uh, overall, uh, it's at least a decent game. Okay. At least better than some of the other movie games that have come out. Yep. I mean, Thor. Thor was a huge it. failure. Yeah, Thor was a I huge failure. Yeah. I would give it. Oh, and this is a great moment. It's a slow mo timing. Yeah, shoot some guys. And you have to shoot those bullets in case. Ow! Some bullets will hit you and you have to counter shoot them in time. Oh! You sell the sea shooting game, the yeah. counter shoot bullets! And shoot that red marking bullet right there and you have to shoot it. You may shoot. You gotta run out of that too. I love fast-paced games. Yep, fast-paced games are our style of beat. Mm -hmm. Ouch! <laughs> he got no ball. Okay, um... I don't think we'll be able to show you the bullet curving because uh, there's some... It's quite far away, uh, but I will show you this though. Uh, remember from the movie, guys, if you watch the movie, there's a bitch of a girlfriend that he has in the movie. You can kill her now. And earn yourself a trophy. Like this. Wait a minute, let's see. Ah, half the man Barry is. If you know what's the movie reference, go for you. <laughs> well, okay, and we've come to the boss battle. It runs in the family, shit pants. Yes, of course. But time. Okay. Let's fight this bastard. Uh, what is the needle? Yep. Oh, I can't shoot you there. It's okay. Oh my, we'll get him soon. I'm trying to get shit the helicopter. Get to that job. Okay, we are gonna fight him. Weapon wise, that's only handguns. Wise, you have a handgun, and later you will unlock some other guns. Like uh, there's a there's a dual handgun that the father carries that you can uh, later unlock for your own usage. Yeah, which is a very nice gun. You, it's a it's like a high cap magazine, uh, full auto weapon. You can spray about five bullets at one go. Yeah. Okay. And let's get this fucker. Let's get it from here. Some fire. Uh, and let's get it from here again. Taking him out. Do this. And we shot him in his ass and we just got our first bullet curving uh, logo so we can do some uh, bullet curves if we kill Wait. some enemies. Go and let me just show you the curving bullet training. Finally, we have reached the most That's awaited area of training. They taught me not okay, yep. And we have another trophy. Completed yeah. Act 1 on easy. <laughs> 
And just so you know guys, the name for the easy mode is called Pussy. Which is quite funny. Yeah. Don't piss your okay. pants if you can't see. Let's see some bullet coming. What if no one ever told you that bullets fly straight? What would you do? <laughs> Okay, this is how you aim your, uh, for bullet curving. You press the R1 button and hold, and you turn the analog stick till it uh, till the the target highlights white in color, and you release the R1 button and you curve bullets. And let's do some more targets. There's even a mode where you will look at the bullets curving cinematically. Okay. You really think pulling off crazy shit like that comes for free? Yeah. You gotta You have to earn your bullet time. Your curving bullets are earned by adrenaline. So you have to kill enemies in order to get your curving. That guy's a douchebag. He's holding up for guarantee. It's done common. Okay, this guy is hiding behind cover, so we're gonna take him out with bullet time and slow mo bullet kill. Ooh, that is very lovely. Ow. And if you kill one guy, if you miss one guy with the bullet curve, you have to earn your kill again. Okay, so that's pretty much it for our one third review.